Hey, this is Brett with Summit Auto in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep and Jeep Wrangler headquarters. And today we are checking out this brand new, extremely good looking 2021 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Rubicon. This one has the color match hardtop and fenders. It has the special um, painted and polished lipped rims. It also has the premium audio and navigation group, has the leather trimmed bucket seats, and it has the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 motor. It's gonna get you 285 horsepower, 260 foot pounds of torque. It's gonna get you 24 miles per gallon on the highway, 19 city, and an average of 21 miles per gallon on a full size Wrangler, pretty amazing. And that's with help in the uh, with the 8-speed automatic transmission and, of course, the e-torque um, system that's on here. If you want to check out all the photos on this Wrangler, you can check out our website in the upper right-hand part of the screen, a link to this vehicle if it's still available. Painted alloy rims with the polished aluminum lips on there. It also has BF Goodrich all-terrain tires, these are LT285 70R17s, and these rims are a $995 option to get those special rims. Has definitely an all-terrain tread pattern on it. The Rubicons all come with the rock rails on the side. You get the granite crystal Jeep and trail rated logos with the red outlines. Get the Rubicon stickers on the side. This one also comes with the LED lighting group. Get the LED fog lamps, the LED running lights, the LED headlamps, and the LED halo lamps there. Granite crystal inserts on the seven slotted grill. You get the red tow hooks. This one has the plastic bumpers. You can get the metal bumpers on here. The sport hood with the in color induction there, or the inlets. Couple little Easter eggs on this vehicle. You get these sandals on the plastic shroud there, and you also have the Jeep climbing up the side. You get the Torx 50 on the door hinges, so you know which Torx wrench to use. This one also has the enter and go proximity key system, so you just have to put your hand in the handle there, and it'll automatically unlock if you have the keys in your pocket. 2021 Wrangler Unlimited Rubicon, 3.6 liter, eight-speed automatic transmission. I'm not gonna go through everything. Here are all your um, standard equipment options on here, and then the optional equipment. The black clear coats, 245 leather trim bucket seats are $15.95. This is a customer preferred package, 25R. Cold weather groups, 995, gives you the heated seats and remote start. I think it also gives you the heated steering wheel, but they don't have it on here. Um, LED lighting group, $12.95, I think that's definitely worth it. 8.4 in premium audio group is $18.95, gives you the Alpine premium audio system with the factory subwoofer, the Uconnect um, navigation system in the 8.4. You also get Sirius Guardian for a year and traffic, Travel Link and Traffic Plus for five years. Has the dual top group, so it has the soft top in the back of here, that's $23.95 option. And then the 8-speed and uh, 3.6 liter are $3,000 combined. The proximity key is $545. And then the hard top that's color matched is $1,300. You also have the color match fender flares, which are $695. And the uh, rims that are special there are $995. Uh, so it looks like the color match fenders and top would be $1,995 combined. $58,665 is your MSRP if you want to get your summit price in the upper right hand part of your screen is a link to that. 5 years 60 powertrain, 3 year 36 bumper to bumper. Your average miles per gallon is 21, 19 city 24 which still blows me away. My uh, old JK used to only get 16 at best. Um, 4 star front crash test rating and 3 star rollover. And we'll continue on with the outside and then we'll check out more of the interior. You have the four wheel disc brakes and I believe they're heavy duty on the uh, Wranglers, or on the uh, Rubicons I should say. You do get the plastic 3M tape on the front of the back fenders. Now what that does is it protects that from rock chips, which is nice that they're thinking about the investment. Um, you know, because Wranglers, they are a lot of money and they do hold their value, so you want them to hold their condition too. Got the red tow hook in the back, the LED license plate lights. Get a better look at that 
rim and tire tread pattern. And then you saw that there was the backup camera. That is an HD backup camera, which is really nice, and we'll check that out in a second. So back here, these hard tops come off almost identical to the old ones. You have three bolts on each side and then two on the top for a total of eight, and then you have two quick disconnects for your electrical and your washer fluid. They do store in there now. This is the box for the soft top, and then this is your case for the front hard top pieces. There is a subwoofer right there. I'm sorry, right there. Uh, these are all painted on the bars, so when you do have the hard top off, everything matches. Looks really good. These back doors, they made them a lot lighter. Um, they swing a lot smoother. You get the JL badge right there for wheelbase and overall length and then uh, water fording and stuff like that. So that's pretty cool. You get the LED tail lamps there as well. The metal fuel door. And uh, we'll check out the inside. It does have the power heated mirrors. Inside those leather trimmed bucket seats are really nice. Get the red stitching throughout, the red Rubicon stitched into the backrest. Driver seat height adjuster, lumbar, factory floor mats, power mirrors, power locks. Uh, these seats now come standard with side airbags. And we'll hop inside here and check everything out. We have the cool Jeep Rubicon animation that starts up when you start the vehicle. Um, you do get a digital speedometer there, you get a compass, and then usually it's an outside temperature display. You can change those to be whatever you want. You get the heated leather wrap steering wheel, cruise controls on the right, Bluetooth and information center controls on the left, and then audio controls on the back of the steering wheel. Notice you do get that red finish dash. It does have that 8.4 with a navigation system. AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities. You also have your heated seats and heated steering wheel controls there. You can check out your backup camera here as well and check out just how crystal clear and HD that is. Um, really, really sweet. Those are dynamic grid lines too, so they turn as you turn the steering wheel, which is really neat. And then if you were to ever put a hitch on here, that center line would line right up with your receiver hitch. Now you can do your climate controls here. You also have dual climate controls, select where the air is blowing, AC, all that good stuff up there. And then you also have all the apps that go with this vehicle. So you can do your heated seats, your Wi-Fi hotspot, notifications, uh, you can do the market, has projection manager where if you have a navigation system or if you have Apple CarPlay or Android Auto on your cell phone, you can project it to the screen um, through a USB cord and then project it to the screen. So if you have a different navigation system on your cell phone, such as Waze or Google Maps, you can project that to the screen and then uh, use it through the screen there. It works as, works as well with media and songs and stuff like that. So we actually did a video on Android Auto. If you want to check that out, it's in the upper right-hand part of the screen. And then you have the off-road pages here, which are pretty cool. They take a second to load, so while they're loading, down here you have the um, all the other tactile buttons for your climate. If you don't like doing them on the screen, you also have your volume and tune controls on there for the radio, your start-stop capabilities, stability control, downhill assist control, and you can just turn that whole screen off if you don't like it. So, speaking of those off-road pages, you have the drivetrain right there. you got steering angle, so as you turn that steering wheel, you're going to see just how much your angle is. you got your transfer case, whether you're in too high, four high, or four low. And then for the Rubicon, you have sway bar disconnect, axle lock for front and rear. So if you have those locked, it'll tell you that they're locked. Also the sway bar, if it's connected or not. So that's pretty good information to know. You also have your coolant temp, oil temp, battery voltage, trans temp, and oil pressure. And then you have your pitch and roll, which right now we're completely level in our picture studio. So that's a good thing. Um, and then you have your latitude, longitude, as well as the altitude there. And because we're in the building, I don't think the altitude's accurate. Um, sometimes it tells me 800 feet, sometimes it tells me 1,000, sometimes it tells me zero, but I think it's just because the building's interfering with the satellites. Anyways, AUGS, USB, and USB-C. 
This is what makes a Rubicon a Rubicon. You get the front and rear axle lockers. Um, you can do front and rear together, or you can just do the rear. And then you have the sway bar disconnect and off-road plus mode. 4x4 four four shifter on the floor, 8-speed automatic transmission. You get the little Jeep on the top there. Notice that red stitching is throughout the entire vehicle. The parking brake, the transmission shifter, the 4x4 four four shifter, everything. So really cool. has the heavy-duty key fob with the uh, switchblade style key. Also has remote start on there and panic. Heavy-duty Jeep logo. It's nice and heavy. You always know which key fob that you have in the vehicle. I know I... I always say that during these videos, but I really do like the key fobs. You get the red stitching on the dash. Up here you have an auto dimming mirror. You also have assist and SOS buttons that comes with that premium sound and audio group. Uh, and then you get the quick disconnects on these front hardtop pieces, very similar to the JKs. Um, you also have home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems. Now you could not get those with uh, the old JKs. Home link was not available with the JK Wranglers. Anyways, we'll do one more final walk around here and I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video you will have been able to tell just some of the options and the overall styling and looks on this particular Wrangler. Learn a little bit about the Rubicon package. Got to check out the LED lighting group here which is my favorite part about these new Wranglers. How good those lights look, how bright they are. And uh, thanks again for checking out the video and to see more pictures of this Wrangler, one of our other 450 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we got it, go to our website, www.summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. In fact, in a second, you'll see a link to subscribe to our YouTube channel on your left. A link to more Wrangler videos like this one on your right. If you have not been to our website, on the bottom link to this vehicle on our website, click those, check us out. And we really look forward to helping you with this brand new 2021 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Rubicon with the color match hardtops in uh, black clear coat. Thanks again for checking out the video.